Hello, it's Dougie here. Today we'll be doing a different type of video. Uh, I'll be talking with the video as it plays along. Uh, I didn't script any of this, and yeah. So we're trying to beat the game without pressing B too many times. It's impossible to beat the game without pressing B from what I did. And yeah, so I'll show you the best route and how to, you know, skip some areas where it looks like you have to press B, but y but you don't have to. So yeah, here we go. So first we, uh, you know, go through the tutorial and get the key up here uh, by getting on these rails and yeah we don't have to click on B uh, for now we just uh, you know get through this level with ease and this one all you have to do is just defeat enemies this is the first level and that's pretty much it so next we go right we don't go left I'll explain later in the video why I didn't take certain paths because it gets really difficult and yeah I'm showing you the path right now I'm taking uh, it's kind of, kind of weird. It's sort of long, but that's the only way to, you know, beat the levels without pressing B too many times. So yeah, I'm gonna fast forward through most of these, just because uh, you don't have to click on B, and it's explaining each level is gonna take too long. So yeah, we go right as I said, and we just wait until this video loads. And here we go. We run into our first problem. P taking both routes makes us click on B. So what we do here is a uh, whole B. Um, as you'll see here, I tried to find a way to get around it, but it's, um, it's, uh, I couldn't. So yeah, you just hold, you click press B, then hold it, because we'll need it for later. So yeah, that's me trying to attempt, uh, getting over that. And so, by, by holding B, we get an extra, I guess, bounce, or a, bi a, a bigger bounce, to get, um, to other obstacles that we couldn't get to without pr holding B. And yeah, we're still gonna hold B. Uh, for this part, and we're still gonna hold it after we beat the level for another level. I'll show you uh, in a second. So yeah, we just keep on going right. Nothing too difficult here. We're still holding B. Then we continue going right to this level right here. All we have to do is just take the 8-ball to the goal, and that's pretty much it. There's no major obstacles to get through. And to the next level we go. Then we go north. Uh, we're still holding B. Uh, it gets difficult to you know, get to some areas without jumping B, but it's still possible, as you see here. So yeah, we got this level completed. So we're gonna go north again. So we're still holding B, and this is the level we're gonna need it for. So once we go down here, uh, there's gonna be uh, a trap or whatever, and it's gonna damage us, and we need it. We need it to damage us to leave the rail. And while we leave, we're gonna be bouncing on, I guess, the floor, and try to go over one of the rails so we can get uh, to another rail uh, by jumping, so we can get all the targets. Uh, I tried, uh, you know, not pressing B and beating this level, but it's uh, it's impossible, even with this long range weapon. So yeah, this is where we use B. We're still gonna be holding it for the next level. And yeah, we beat it. And this is the level we're going to be needing B for. So once we get past this part, we're going to hit another bounce pad, and this is where we—that's the reason we need to hold B to get over to get over there, or else we'll you know fall to our doom. And we don't need to be hold be holding B anymore for now. Uh, we just got to get through the levels. Uh, this one you didn't need any B presses at all. Um, it's a girl power station. Not too hard, I guess. So here, uh, I ran into a problem master shape. This is the best route I could take. and uh, You need to press B to get to the goal. I tried everything, but it didn't work out. So yeah, here's another B press. And we still go north. Uh, this we didn't need any B presses for this, but I just showed a little clip right there showing it's possible to get to the you know the battle arena and fight the boss without pressing B. So yeah, on this one, all we have to do is take out enemies on top of platforms that can break. And yeah, no B presses uh, for this one too. This one uh, got a little bit tricky, but you didn't need to click on B 
at all. You just have to like hit those things where like it makes the traps move to the side and that's pretty much it. No B presses on this one. So yeah, we're taking this path to get to the other things and uh, yeah, this level, we didn't need any B presses at all. All we have to do is just get each little circle thing. And this one, it was a bit tricky as well, but you don't you don't need any B presses for this one. All you have to do is just be careful and you know get to the goal. Boom. So the next level, uh, we didn't need any B presses at all. Um, it was just simple, not too hard. And this one, we didn't need any B presses as well. As you can see here, all we're doing is just uh, shooting this little ink thingy to take out all the boxes. This is where we're going to need three B presses. Uh, I tried to find a way around it, but it's imp uh, I couldn't. I guess it's impossible to get around this without three B presses. So yeah, as you saw there, we had to get to the uh, first platform by jumping over and this is, we're gonna jump over this one too I tried getting down there without jumping but it's impossible from what I uh, did I guess so this is where we're gonna need the third one to get to the sponge and after that we don't need any more it's you can easily get to the other one without jumping as you can see here and yeah level complete So after this, we just beat this level, not too hard, no B presses uh, needed for this one. And we're just taking out enemies on this level, no B presses on this one as well. And for this one, we need no B presses. We're just taking the eight ball back to the goal. Nothing blocking or stopping our way. Then we go down here. Nothing too tricky. We didn't need B for this. All we have to do is just get on these little things and you know get to the goal. And for this one, uh, all you have to do is just take out targets uh, with the uh, chargers. Not too difficult as well. And this one, uh, this one did get a bit of tricky, but uh, the last enemy is too far away for us to get to it. So instead, we save the stingray for the you know the last enemy that's far away, or else we'll have to jump and you know take out the enemy like that. So this one, we're gonna need to press B once. The first and second stage, it's possible to get up there and damage the uh, boss. But the third stage, you'll see in a second, we'll have like these little metal things blocking the sides where you can't climb on it. And I tried finding a way to, you know, attack it from like down there, but it's impossible from what I did. So yeah, you're gonna have to climb on it and then, you know, attack this last stage like this. That's another B press. So for this level, this one got a bit tricky. There was a little wall block in our way, but with enough speed, we can get over this no problem. And we get to the goal of this. Now for the next level, we don't do anything. We just use a cannon and you know try to protect the orb. And yeah, no B presses needed for this one. And after that, we were able to get all the things. So we got the first thing. The second thing. The third thing. And the fourth thing. Yeah, if we go to the left, 
you'll see in a second why we didn't take it so with the baller we're gonna have to jump to these platforms and we need like about five jumps to beat the stage or six I wasn't I uh, didn't count because uh, it already had a lot and I wasn't too worried about this route So yeah, the reason I didn't take the route on the south is because if we go up here, we're going to have to deal with these uh, rail stages and you have to jump to every single one. I tried holding B and, you know, skipping some things because when you hold B, you can you get a, a bigger jump or whatever when you leave the rail. And yeah, here's the other stage where uh, it has a lot of rails. We can't go around it. It's like we're blocking multiple paths and that sucks. So we got another one with rails. It has too many. That's why we didn't take the pass on the south. And on this one, the path on the pink side, uh, we have like two obstacles blocking our way. Uh, first, we got this stage right here. We need like about five jump press, five B presses, and that was too much. Um, and the stage before that, we still needed to jump. Uh, as you'll see in a second. So yeah, these are, I guess, the platforms we need to get on. So at the stage before, we needed two B presses. Want to get right here to follow the eight ball, and then the next one is to get on this weird thingy. And here's the final stage. Uh, I couldn't find a way to get on this thing. There was a little glitch I seen before. Uh, I'll show right now is where you create ink on the ground out of nowhere uh, I don't know how this was created or how this glitch was done it was by accident uh, so yeah this is the whole thing in slow motion as you see here ink was made out of nowhere and then I threw my curling bomb and if I can do it here then I could get a speed boost and get to the uh, other platform without jumping and then this is our other jump on the stage and here's another one and there's another one right here. I couldn't find any other way to get around it. And we gotta get over this one too. But we're gonna hold B on this one. Because we'll need it for this one. If you let go of this thing while holding B, you get a bigger jump. And we're still gonna be holding it for this one as well. We're not pressing, uh, we're not clicking on B, we're just holding it. And yeah, we just needed to get around, I don't know, this stage. And after that, you can let go. And for this stage, I this is the best route I could find uh, to get around all these uh, to get our, to get to the goal without pressing B too many times. So yeah, we just wait for this thing to get down here. So yeah, that was one B press, and we don't need a B press to get over here. And then here's the other B press. And we need one more to get to the platform over there. And here's our last B press for this weird side of the map. And we're gonna need two here. I tried my I tried my best to get around it, but it's impossible. You fall in the water if you try to, you know, not jump. And for this one, to get the we need to get the key first and then take it to the right. Uh, we don't need any B presses to get down there. Uh, we just, you know, have to be careful and be quick. We take out the enemies because they're a bother. So yeah, here we go. Getting the key. And for this one, we need two B presses to get to the uh, the area where you have to put the key in. I tried uh, every way possible to get over there without pressing B too many times, but two is necessary to beat the level from what I did, as you can see in a second. So here's our first one, and then here's our second one. And after that, we encounter these laser thingies. We can get around most of them just by eating the wall or just timing it right where uh, you can get through the uh, lasers because some of them move. 
So yeah, I'm just showing examples of how I got through it. And this is one of the tricky ones. This one sort of looked impossible, but it was easy. Uh, all I have to do is just hang on the wall and fall off right when uh, it gets really close to you so you can get through the holes. And for the area coming up, we needed to be presses. We couldn't ink the wall uh, and get around the first laser, so uh, we have to jump over it. And then we just go around the other lasers and, you know, activate the thing and go back by using this wall. And then we're going to have to uh, get a good beat press over here to get over two lasers. And after that, you can just ink the wall and go over the last one. And we need a beat press to get over here. I tried my best to not use one, but it's it's not possible from what I did. And we don't need one for that. And there's some tricky obstacles uh, to get to if you don't click on B. Uh, but it's still possible to get some of the uh, the little goal thingies. And for this one to get up here, we needed to click on B. I tried my best timing the inkjet where it, you know it gets to the highest point and I can get on the wall, but it's not high enough. And we need to click on B one more time to get to the last goal thingy. And we don't need a B press for this the second last stage. And the last stage is the final boss. Uh, we didn't need any B presses to beat it. And yeah. Defeated. And for the final boss, uh, we... Don't need any B presses for this, but we had some close calls. I'll show why because we have like a lot of rails, but most of them you can just like you know uh, shoot this little thingy and they'll zoom you to the next rail. And so yeah, for this one, we just wait for the yellow missiles to uh, the yellow bombs. I mean, to get here, we just fall off on one of the rails. We don't jump on it, and yeah, we just you know play the game uh, as usual. And for this one. Uh, it looked impossible at first, but all you have to do is just throw a splat bomb to get the the pink bomb right there. And after that, you can just attack the blue bombs uh, around the face of the final boss, I guess. So yeah, we beat the game at 25 B presses. Thanks again for uh, watching, guys. And thank you, Link, for the snowball microphone. This is the first time uh, me using the microphone she sent me. Uh, I'll credit uh, her channel in the description below. And yeah, I love this microphone. It's so wonderful. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it <laughs> for now, I guess. But I don't think it'll have problems ever. Just because, you know, Ling picks the best gifts. So, yeah. Thanks again for watching. See ya!